Hi everyone, Aaron here for Zolotech, and today Apple released iOS 10.3.2 Beta 3. This came in at about 210 megabytes for me. It wasn't a huge download or anything like that. It installed pretty quickly, as expected. Let's take a look at the version number. You can see this is version 14F5080A. And according to Apple's notes, this really has nothing as far as what's in the update. Anytime you have a point two and then a point something after that so three digits long you're really not going to see anything new or anything like that so in this update though so far everything has been opening quickly uh, my apps seem to be loading okay and actually I was having some issues with the App Store before and this seems to be working a little bit better so when I open it and and do the updates I know some people were having issues with the updates and the updates you hit update and it wouldn't work properly aside from that though I had no issues with the previous beta and many of you that responded when I asked on Twitter had no issues with it either a few of you had a few small bugs here and there but battery life has been pretty good on the previous one and we'll see how it is on this one now I did some benchmarks so let's go back here and this is the current benchmark this is a Geekbench score I did it twice to, and got very similar results so 3520 for single core and 5960 for multi-core if I go to the previous week you'll see it's 3329 and 5963 so very very similar for multi-core and a little bit faster for single core now that's not going to mean a whole lot except for maybe some performance just doing everyday tasks so for me this has been fine but again it may speed up for anyone that was having issues previously if you had speed issues or anything like that so that's it for this particular beta i'll leave a link to this wallpaper in the description below and this particular wallpaper was sent in by apple hack so thanks for sending it if you'd like to send me a wallpaper please do that at zolotech at my twitter account i'll leave it in the description or here to the left and that's it for this particular update not a whole lot going on we'll see ios 11 in june and this one will probably be another few betas before they release it to the public and it's just bug fixes and security fixes let me know any issues you've had in the comments below if you haven't subscribed already please subscribe and like as always thanks for watching this is aaron i'll see you next time